Hello everybody and welcome back to Golden Dragon Games. I'm your host Rocky2815 and we have not done a video since the 15th of this month. It's the February. Oh, time flies by so fast, doesn't it? But anyway, I have got three mysterious minifigure bags from series 13 to show you. Well, unbag rather. Oops. Everything keeps going wrong with my sets. Don't know why. But just get me scissors and let's start unbagging these. And the first minifigure is the Space Trooper. And I'll be back once I have built him. Okay, I'm back. I've done building him, so let's just move him out of the way for a second. Over here. So I'm back. The second packet. What will be in this one? I do wonder. Oh man, not again. It's about the third one I got. Like, literally, this is. I've got three classic kings, and this is my third snake charmer, but uh, I might as well show him off, but like I did with the first one, I'll be back once I built him. Okay, I'm back, and I've built the snake charmer. So, let's put him to one side, open our final packet, and then I will zoom in and go through some of the details and printing on all of them. Come on, please don't be a double, a triple, or what have you, what is it, what is it, what is it, it's, oh, not a double, <coughs> or triple, so we've got the, uh, what's its head, Lady Cyclops, so I'll be back when I've built her, okay, I've built her, and I think it's pretty successful haul, actually, I've got two new figures and a triple that's not too bad really so let's go in for the closer zoom back in a minute hey and here's the space trooper up close i believe that's what he's called anyway so his accessory are two blasters these are sort of blasters you normally see in lego sets now including the helmet um i believe it's from lego galaxy squad series the chest mold the rather chest plate mould I think is new because on the back it has these holster bits where you can easily put his guns maybe pretend it's some sort of jetpack even <laughs> and for printing wise I think it's pretty good print on the front no printing on the back no yet yeah, there's a silver insignia on the back there's some printing on the helmet just like a line and there's some knee pads and some sort of vertical line joints I would guess you would call them and I'll just take him apart to show you he has actually no front printing and no back printing so let's put him back together uh, also he has a double sided face forgot to mention so, visor, a non-visor. I didn't realise that till I just picked his head up. So, let's do a quick 360 and move on to the next minifigure. Okay, on to Snake Charmer now. So, he's got some nice print on the front. I always like to see detail in the print on the front, especially when he... See the uh, bead, orange beads he's got? See in between the orange beads there's a tiny bit of gold. So it's like the thread that goes through the beads which is quite nice. And then his torso printing actually continues to like shorts. I wish Lego made the printing that's just, you know, here. Carry on to the side and also around to the back. He has no back printing, no alternate face. I do like the Lego Turban piece, and it's nice to see that back. 
I like this shocked face, sort of like, sort of Mario, almost. And then, he's got his flute, I guess you would call it. Um, it's just a standard Lego Harry Potter wand, I think. And then, the snake, the cobra, I absolutely love it, because its tail wraps around nicely, and got little indentations in the plastic to make it look more scaly, some nice front printing. Wish they could have done the printing on the eyes and the tongue. Like, maybe the eyes would have been too difficult, but the tongue they could have done. But also, he has got these bits which allows him to fit into a stud, so he's a bit more backwards, and now he's lunging out at you. Uh, so... I'll give you a 360 quickly at the both of them, and we'll move on to the last figure. And also, I forgot to mention, the Cobra has some lovely back printing on the back of his head. Okay, on to the last mini figure. We've got a male green Cyclops. I think I accidentally called this a troll earlier, but never mind. Uh, but now we've got a female one in this, I don't know what colour blue this would be, so some lipstick, a beauty spot, a club, <coughs> again with the torso printing that continues down to like shorts, apart from this time, which I'm a much more pleased about, is the printing actually continues around the side and to the back. I wish they could have just done under the first two stud pieces to where the uh, minifig obviously sits down. Um, back printing, you know, rip shirt. And the club piece is, if I can get wrestling out of this Cyclops's hand, is a nice light grey, but it is still the standard club piece we would see. And if we take the initial headpiece off, we've got a smiley face with eyelashes, and then we've got, I don't know what you would call that face, I guess, uh, like she's looking at maybe the male cyclops and is in love or something, but if we put it down, you can just about see the blue eyeliner on the top of her head, so she's angry, she's in love, and happy, mad, happy. That's about it for the troll, so I'll put the club back in her hand, do a 360, and then outro the video. Okay, I'm back, I've got them all lined up so you can see all of them in their glory, and thank you very much for watching this very short video, I thought I'd try and get a video out before the end of the month because it's <coughs> a couple of days to the end of the month, less than a week actually, and like I said I haven't uploaded since the 15th, that's crazy, that's not like me anymore, I used, I went for a period without uploading a video for two months I know, but like, I try not to do that, but anyway, this video has been rambling on too long enough, so thank you everybody for watching the video, make sure to tune in next time for the next video, have no idea what it will be, but uh, I guess we can make it a surprise, or what not, um, so remember to leave a thumbs up, uh, I can't get my, I just can get about my thumbs up in camera, never mind, uh, thumbs up, a like, and rating would be a lovely. Remember to share this with all your friends. And also subscribe for more awesome video content. Lego and video game and comedy related. So until next time. Stay golden, stay frosty and bye Z's.